Today, we leave the Escambray Mountains and travel to Camaway. We start in a Russian truck, transfer to our coach, and travel to our first stop, the Slave Tower, in the valley of the Sugar Mills. Our lunch stop is in Sancti Spiritus, In the afternoon, we travel on to Camaway. We leave Hacienda Codina by an unmetalled forest track. This gives way to a metal road as we descend towards Trinidad. At the edge of the park, we say goodbye to our truck driver and rejoin our coach. Our next stop is at the Slave Tower, Torre de Manaka Isnaga. It's a tourist hotspot. There are sugarcane juice cellars. Fruit cellars, drapery stalls and trinket cellars. We get a good view of all this from up the tower. The tower was built to watch over slaves, provides a commanding view of the mansion and the surrounding valley. There are a set of viewpoints on the sixth floor. The old mansion is now a restaurant. Our lunch stop was at Sancti Spiritus. We saw more of the traditional grill-fronted Spanish architecture as we wandered through town. Anne wasn't sure whether this was a statue or a street performer. Phone users congregated at the Wi-Fi hotspot in the square. Shops like this one are strangely without signage. The restaurant was beside the river, which was overlooked by poorer housing. Music and young dancers accompanied our meal. Soon we're on our way again to Camaway. We pass fields of sugar canes, harvested cane fields, and sugar cane factories. And by five o'clock, we're in Camaway. We walked from the coach to our hotel and were welcomed with hot towels and more cocktails before going on to our rooms. That evening we explored the old town as we went to supper. Music filled the night as we returned to our hotel.